Philippine amateur basketball action continued Sunday with a 5-0 Ace Hardware Aces taking on the winless Jazzy Sixers at the St. John's Gym. I know what you're thinking, no problem, right? Well, it would appear that way as the Aces wasted no time pulling out the guns and shooting their way to a commanding 26-0 lead over the Sixers in the first quarter. The Sixers finally put points on the board just before the end of the quarter thanks to John Saponto, who sank five straight to trail 28-7. But hold on. The Sixers were determined to show the Aces and the rest of the league that they were real. LV Harris and Kerry Taylor brought the Sixers within 11 points, 30 to 19. But once again, the Sixers lost their grip, going down by 17 points at the half, 40 to 23, and remained in that 17-point deficit through the third quarter. But the Sixers kept swinging and capitalized on two different spurts that got the attention of the first-place Aces, who found themselves hanging on to preserve their lead. But the Sixers' efforts fell short as two late turnovers spoiled any chances of the upset. The Aces glad Sadly settled for the 81-78 victory over the Sixers, who have yet to pick up a win. The Aces' J.P. Cruz led the way with 26 points and teammate Reggie Rechebong added 22. In the loss, the Sixers' Harris gave it his all, dropping a game-high 36 points. In other PABL games, PC Outlet dropped the Kings 89-83, with Francis Benitez finishing with 23 points and Jun Navarro adding 18. The Kings' Vince Kidigo and Tony Bora finished with 20 and 18 points on the day. Let's not forget the ladies. The Lady Aces' Mallory Duenas drained 36 points en route to a 50-44 victory over Los Energy, who had 11 points from Michelle Guzman. And in the final game, the Lady Bombers abused the Junior Women's National Team 78-39. Joy Bird had 24 points and Don Higginbottom had 21 for the Bombers, while Darren Santos had 14 in the loss for the Nationals. For PNC Sports, I'm Jason Camacho.